there's something very strange going on with that type of stuff where there's selective funding and certain narratives some narratives that you would think are just innocuous on you on their own right such as what you're describing this viking dna thing this guy is just finding out information and sharing it and for some reason or another there's some interests out there that don't want that out there for whatever reason people who are just getting into american archaeology specifically if they understood the gilded age which is about like the 1880s 1890s that was like the golden age of archaeology where they were discovering all these mounds in north america they had detailed descriptions serpent mound being one of the more prominent ones that has resurfaced again with great Graham Hancock's work. He's picking up where they left off back almost 120 years ago now. And if people were aware of that, they could see how low quality it really is out there right now in terms of the speed at which new discoveries are being processed. Yeah, I was, I'm was. i reading a book right now called Prehistoric World um, or the Vanished Races.